for today's video I'm going to film a little realistic day in my life vlog. It's currently about the middle of the day actually. I've been to college this morning, I only had the one lesson so I figured I'd just like um, film once I got home from that. It's also my sister's birthday today so I didn't really have a chance to film anything this morning but I did just want to film like a little vlog today. Uh, I've got like some homework and stuff that I need to go on with but I don't know if I'll end up getting it all done today or if I'll actually even start any of it. But it is like a nice day today and everything. I, ain't really got, I haven't got really anything planned. I might go for like a walk this afternoon or something once I have like lunch and everything. So this is the outfit I'm wearing today. This top is from Primark, the hoodie is as well and then the jeans are from Sheen. It's kind of like an outfit I wear all the time. Someone did suggest that I should do a video like building my outfits but honestly I don't really know how I do that because my style like I mainly wear like all like the same kind of outfit like just like t-shirt and jeans but in like different colours. So I was kind of thinking about maybe getting some more clothes before I did that kind of video. But this is the outfit that I'm wearing today. I um, was just gonna wear the t-shirt and jeans, but it's quite cold outside, so I put the hoodie on as well. So uh, first, just want to talk about some of like the books that I've been reading recently. I do like to talk about like books and stuff on my channel, and I'm trying to get really like back into reading stuff recently. Holiday last week, which is why I didn't upload, but I did get a chance to read a lot of books. So I'm gonna talk about the ones that I did get to read. The first one, this is Gilded by Marsha Maya. I've been saying about reading this for quite a while channel because it did take me a while it's quite slow at the beginning but once you get into it it gets really good I really really enjoyed this book it's probably like a five stars for me I'm really excited for the sequel as well because obviously it's a duology but the second one hasn't come out yet so this is the only one out for now but it's a really good book and the cover's really pretty I like that it's like the gold like shines in the light and stuff and so yeah I did really enjoy this book and I really it like helped me to remember why I really like, like fantasy books so much as well because it was a lot of like I really enjoyed like that element of the book. And then the other books that I've read, The Love Hypothesis. I don't know if I've talked about this on before in my channel, but this is like one of my old time favourite books. I just bought it like because I bought some books I haven't read before and, and I bought this in case I wasn't like really enjoying them or anything. Um so I did end up reading this. This is just it's just one of my favourite books. It is a really good book. Although in my Waterstones they put it in like the young adult section, it is definitely not for like it's more like an 18 plus kind of book. But I do, this is a really really good book and I do really enjoy it. I think there's so much hype around it on like TikTok and stuff and it definitely deserves it. It's just so good. And then the last one is It Ends With Us. This one, it's a good book but a lot of people say like oh, it's like a really like, sad book, it's really depressing. I honestly found it's got a lot of like trigger warnings and stuff um, with it. There's like a lot of like abuse and stuff in it and I just kind of found it a bit more, dis more like disturbing and stuff than like sad like a lot of like the fantasy books I read you know they're like they've got like a sad ending as well like people die and stuff but this was more just like and disturbing rather than sad so I'd like check like all the trigger ones and stuff if you're gonna read this book it wasn't a bad book but it wasn't that great either also, uh, I also at some point need to go get a new some new book I also at some point need to go get some new books from Waterstones because they've got like a rewards card where if you get like 10 points then you get like £10 to spend on anything and so I've earned that now so I'm gonna go I wanna go buy a new book at some point but I don't know when I'll get channel because I'm like working over the weekend and everything and it's obviously like my sister's birthday and stuff today but I do need to go and do that at some point I've, I did buy some books the other day but my points haven't come through yet so I did get the money off them but I do need to go buy myself a new book at some point so I've just finished a bit of working on my sister's cake for her birthday, um, which is why I kind of like I have like icing sugar and stuff in my shirt. So I don't know well you will be able to tell on camera, but I do. So I'm gonna get changed in a bit, but I'm not gonna get ready yet. I'm gonna we're gonna have pizza later, so I'm gonna eat that first and then get changed, so that I don't get pizza all over whatever I wear. I think she's been playing Sims this afternoon, so I might need to actually get on with some work now for it, just to like make this video a bit more interesting. But yeah, I spend a lot of like my free time playing The Sims. I know I did make a couple of videos on it and I do really enjoy playing it but I just don't think my videos are that entertaining. So I just I just prefer doing these videos a lot. Also something I've been doing this afternoon is looking at clothes on Romney because because someone has requested that I do like a video on like how I like make my outfits and stuff but I thought rather than doing that what I could do like a mini haul kind of thing because they do on Romney they do these kind of like sets where you get loads of different tops in them and I really like this one it's got this like creamy white coloured shirt but on this like green one, this blue one, the blue one's my favourite, the blue one I really like. And then this like kind of just plain black top, it comes in loads of different colours. 
Um, so I was thinking about maybe buying that for myself, plus I've got some vouchers on there. Yeah, I do really like these tops and I kind of want some more tops for like summer and stuff and I feel like these kind of things would work, work really well, although I'm not sure what kind of colour to get in. And they do a lot of different style ones where you get like a lot of different tops in them and I'm not sure if this is the one I want to go for but I do really like that blue top so it might end up being the one that I pick. It's a lot later on now, I'm honestly, I'm quite tired, it's quite late at night. This is the outfit that I put on, this is a, I just put a jumper on with them, um, it's this from H&M, it's like my favourite jumper, cause, especially because it matches my phone case, so I just like this, I like put together and anything, then I'm going to get ready for bed now because I'm quite tired and stuff, and I'm going to like do like my little night routine and stuff and then go to sleep. Yeah, it's getting quite late now, so I think the last thing I want to do for today is just read the book that I'm reading at the moment, this is Carve the Mark, it's by Veronica Roth, she's the author of like the Divergent series. Which isn't a book I've read, but it's a book from our brother's reading, and he's really enjoying it. And it's like a really popular series and stuff. I have heard, I've not really heard a lot about it. I've heard like a couple of things, and it was on my Amazon wish list for a while. And then I saw it, and I also, because in Watson's, they had the sequel as well. And I really, I really just wanted a series that I could just read, I could get both books and read them. Because obviously, I just read Gilded. And that's just the one book, and the second one it hasn't even come out yet. So I just wanted one where I could complete the series. And they've been really enjoying it, so I'm like, that far, I'm not really that far away through, that was like 100 pages but I'm still kind of at the point where I don't really understand like what's really good on the book but I'm going to keep like reading on with it anyway, I'm enjoying it I do think it's a good book but I just want to want to get to the point where I'm more like, I feel like I'm more understanding what's going on because I feel like that will always happens with fantasy books where it never really makes sense at the beginning and then as you read them on you just like kind of get it but yeah, that is the last thing I'm going to do today so I hope you enjoyed that video Thank you so much for watching, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.